the first time in 30 years the people of India had voted a single party with an absolute majority. The only regret in my life will be that I was never finance minister in a government with an absolute majority. <laughs> in the first government under Mr. Devagauda and Gujral, we had barely 140-150 members. In UPA 1 under Dr. Manmohan Singh, we had 145 members. In UPA 2, under Dr. Manmohan Singh, we had 206 members. 281 seemed like a dream number. But that is what the people of India gave Prime Minister Modi, and I'm quite happy. That is the will of the people. We accept that decision. 282. And then add the allies, it becomes 335 or so. Anything we could have done. With that kind of a majority, we could have done anything. With that kind of a majority, we could have completely reformed the financial sector, we could have passed a direct taxes code, we could have passed a near-perfect GST, I'm not saying any bill will be perfect, but a near-perfect GST could have been passed. With that kind of majority, many laws could have been changed. Anyway, that did not happen. 